How to say days of the week in Japanese. Yeah, Hello, Mina. It's Yana. It's Michin. Today, we're gonna learn how to say the days of the week in Japanese. That's right. Dewa, hajimashou! All right, so to get right into this, days of the week in Japanese is yobi. Yobi. Okay, so you said yobi means day, right? Mm -hmm. Then, for example, in English, we say Monday, right. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, right? Mm -hmm. So you mean that taking the mun out mm -hmm. and having the day, you mean that's yobi? Yes, exactly. Okay. So each of the word, mm -hmm. each of the day has yobi in them. Okay, so there's no exception. It's all, they all have no yobi. No exception, exactly. That's easy. That's easy, right? Cool. Yeah. So you just gotta replace the first part. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. So, mm, yobi, mm, yobi, mm, yobi. Oh, okay, that, that's a good start. Yeah. So not too hard. First have to know yobi. Mm -hmm. Yobi. 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 <laughs> <laughs> All right. So starting with Monday, we have getsu yobi. Getsu yobi. Yes. Getsu. Getsu. Kore ga hiragana. And this is the kanji. So you mean the two kanjis back here mm -hmm. is yobi, mm -hmm. and then the gets over here is the one that changes. Yes, exactly. Replace this one okay. for other days. All okay. right, that's cool. So this is gets yobi, gets yobi, which is Monday. Monday. Next is Tuesday, which is oh, kayobi. <laughs> kayobi. 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 So the hiragana is here. And this is the kanji. So as Monday, we just change the gets into ka. ka. Moving on to Wednesday. Suiyobi. Suiyobi. Sui. Suiyobi. So over here, as you can see, this is the hiragana mm -hmm. and the kanji. So this is Wednesday. Suiyobi. <laughs> so next is Thursday. Thursday wa mokuyobi. Mokuyobi. So, moku, moku, yobi, here's the hiragana, and then the kanji is right here. Yeah, so moku yobi desu. Hai. And my favorite day of the week, Friday. Friday. Kin yobi. Kin yobi. Yes. Kin yobi. Kin. So, here's the hiragana and kanji. Kin yobi. TGIF, guys. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, getting into quite one of the most exciting days of the week, personally for me. Saturday! Saturday! Well, which is? Doyobi. Doyobi. So here's the hiragana once again. Do. And kanji. Here it is. So Saturday, doyobi. Doyobi. And the last one is Sunday and nichiyobi. Nichiyobi. Mm. Nichi. 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 Nichiyobi. And the kanji is here. So let's do a review. Let's do it. First is Monday. Getsuyobi. Tuesday. Kayobi. Wednesday. Suiyobi. Thursday. Mokuyobi. Friday. Kinyobi. Saturday. Doyobi. Sunday. Nichiyobi. Did you guys get it? Well, let's practice with us. So each of the kanji has a meaning. Okay. Mm. Really? Yeah. Oh, so it's they're not just drawings. Well, they're not drawing. They're not just drawings. They have special meanings, and it's quite interesting for days of the week. Mm. Okay. So okay. when you look at Getsuyobi Monday, this kanji means moon. Moon. Mm. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I mean, you can see the curve, right? Mm. right? It does look like a moon. Yes. So it would be easier to actually memorize. Mm -hmm. So when you look at the Monday, how it's spelled M-O-N. Doesn't it look like moon? Monday. Mo yeah. Monday. Yeah, so remember, <laughs> so just remember that Monday has some kind of association with moon. Yeah, so it's Getsuyobi is this, yeah. and the Getsu is moon. Yeah. You got it. And the next one is Kayobi. Mm, Kayobi. Mm, Tuesday. Ka, yes, Ka, it's pretty easy, right? Ka, mm. K, A. Kore wa. This kanji means fire. 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 I mean, the kanji does kind of look like fire if you think of it as drawing. Right, like right. Cute little flames and then the fire. Mm -hmm. Nice. I okay. mean, all kanji started as a drawing. Right? It Kinda, did. Yeah. So it's not that difficult. Mm. So if you do it that way. All right, so next one. Suyobi. So this kanji represents water. 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 Okay. Do you see it? <laughs> I mean, 
it's kind of like a splash water. Oh yeah, splash. I think so. It's splashing. Splash. <laughs> right. So yeah, it's so, suyobi. Suyobi. Oh. Wet. Wed. Ooh. Wet. Wed. That's a good way to memorize, right? right? Yeah. Wet. Wed. Water kanji. Wednesday. Yeah. Wednesday. Suyobi. <laughs> I mean, you have to connect a lot, but at least reading or recognizing the kanji, mm. you could think of a wet splash. Splashing water, Wednesday. See you, be <laughs> right. All right. So next we have mokuyobi. Mokuyobi. Mm. So this kanji represents a tree. Tree. Mm -hmm. So I mean, it looks like a tree. Yeah, it does. It does. With the branches. This pretty easy. Yeah. It does. Mm. It is. So tree. The okay, next one we have kinyobi. Friday. Mm -hmm. Kin. This kanji represents gold slash money. Cha ching cha ching. Yeah. <laughs> Next we have Saturday. Do yobi. Do. This one's pretty easy too. Mm -hmm. Do right? Okay. Do. This kanji represents soil. Soil. So basically like earth. The ground. As you know, when you put it into the elements of the. What do you call it? Four elements. The you know like the powers and everything. Yeah, yeah with the avatar. <laughs> okay, so last but not least, we have Sunday, Nichi Yobi. Nichi. Mm -hmm. So this kanji represents the sun slash day. Oh. Yeah, just, just a regular day. Because you mean like a new sun rising means a new day. Yeah, exactly. Okay, yeah, so that's how it, works. it looks like a squared sun, I think, with one ray. Tashkani. Right. <laughs> but the shape isn't too far. So it's like. It is far, but. A squared sun. Squared sun, yeah. All right, so just a fun fact here though. So each of the kanji for each day of the week, they are actually used to represent a planet or an element in the solar system. Yeah. It's so magical. It's really interesting. Well, I think it's because it's from the ancient times, right? Yeah. So yeah, probably. Fun fact, to be really quick with it, Monday is moon. And then for Tuesday, Mars. Wednesday, Mercury. Thursday, Jupiter. Friday, Venus. Saturday, Saturn. Yes. How do you pronounce it? Sat Saturn. Saturn. I think that's how um, Saturday came from English too. Right. Saturn to Saturn. Saturday. <gasps> Saturn. Yeah. And then Sunday. Nanake. Sun. Oh, sun. <laughs> so my bad. Fun fact. Okay, so today we're teaching you one really useful phrase in Japanese, which is, what day is it today? Because sometimes you forget what day it is, yeah, right? Yeah, I do that all the time. Me too. Since we learned how to say the days of the week in Japanese, now we should also know how to answer when somebody asks and also ask someone when we right. don't know. So let's go learn that phrase. Mm. Okay, you just have to say, Kyo wa nan yobi desu ka? Kyo wa nan yobi desu ka? Yes, okay, let's break it down. Kyo wa nan yobi desu ka? Mm, okay, that's cool. Mm, okay, so kyo wa stands for today. Today. Mm. So today. Today. Nang is what? Oh, it means what? Yeah. So I think this kanji, some of you might have seen it from like nani. Mm. So we s could read it as nani, but from here it's nan. It's nan. Which means this. what? What. Okay. <laughs> and then yobi. Yeah, we learned this. Yeah, we in the beginning. This. Yay. Which means? Day yes. of the week. Of the week. And then this ka. I guess you can think of it as is it? Mm, you know, mm, what mm, day mm. is, what day of the week is, is it? it? Right, yeah. right. And it's a very polite way to ask a question. Mm. So when you ask a question, we usually use this, mm -hmm. and it's the polite version of it. Mm -hmm. We'll show you a very easy example of how to use it. Okay. 今日は何曜日ですか? 今日は金曜日です。TGIF! Ah. All right, thank you so much for watching our video today. And before we finish, we wanted to have a special corner mm. from now on in mm. our Japanese learning videos, right. which is quiz time! Quiz! Everyone's favorite. Yeah, so today's question for you guys is what day is it today for you? Today, right now. Yeah, right now when you're watching this, what day is it today? Write it in Japanese down there. In the comment section. Yeah. And then we would really want to know what day you've watched our videos. Yeah. <laughs> Very curious. So yeah, thank you so much. And while you leave your comment, don't forget to press the like and subscription button. And let us know if you have other requests for us to do. Yes, we would love to um, consider them. Mm -hmm. So first of all, we days of the week.
<laughs> <laughs> days of the week. Days of the week. 